Santa Barbara County is one of the highest percentages of students in the state who do not speak English. And a new state grant that helps students in Los Angeles will also benefit kids in Ventura and in Santa Barbara. News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti takes us inside a Goleta classroom. These are kindergartners at El Camino Elementary School in Goleta. Stephanie Hernandez Jarvis is leading this dual language immersion program. We have a program that now has a TK, kinder, first, second, and third grade in dual language immersion. Students in the program are learning Spanish. They're also learning English. So students who come from homes that already speak Spanish benefit from having their cultural, their linguistic, their whole backgrounds showcased and highlighted and immersed in, in the educational system they're part of. Students from homes where Spanish is spoken also get 30 minutes every day of English development education. But the demand for language achievement is rising in Santa Barbara County. It means that we need to be able to expand our infrastructure, which means that we need more teachers who are bilingual and have their bilingual authorization. School administrators say currently there is a waiting list for all dual language immersion programs in the county. Since 2016, we've increased the number of dual language programs in our county from 2 to 14. Parents really want this for their children. A $10 million state grant will help students with English development education in Santa Barbara and Ventura counties. Is going to be crucial so that we can continue to develop the existing dual language immersion programs we have and we have done so many amazing things but as always there's still room for us to grow well hernandez jarvis is excited about her students progress she looks forward to expanding on this dual learning adventure seeing the program grow we have very strong numbers. Our classes are at maximum capacity with 24 students in each kindergarten and TK class and all the other classes that have students in first grade and second grade and third grade. Es un escucha. Administrators hope all students, including multilingual learners, will develop the tools needed for school and beyond. When our children can think and write and speak and read and communicate in more than one language, the opportunities for them, for their futures, are just endless. In Goleta, I'm News Channel reporter Patricia Martellotti.